Hello everyone, welcome to Monkey Fish channel. In this video, I'm going to show you one of my favorite grappling technique. And this one is really nasty and you should be careful when you do it. I am not one of those masters who say that my techniques are too deadly for sparring. No, no, you can use this thing in the sparring, but just be careful because we don't want to hurt our sparring partner or friend or whatever. So the technique starts here when Gunther have an underhook. This position is dangerous for him when I get over because for me it's really easy to snap his shoulder. How it's called? Standing shoulder, I think. That when he have an underhook and I just hold here around the elbow and just press this way. And some people are crazy and they do like really fast. And this is just stupid in my opinion because you should not try to injure your opponent or like this, like this at least, because this can finish somebody's career. And this is the dangerous part. What I said that it's too deadly to train. No, it's not too deadly, you can still do it, but you should just look out. So here, when you have some, uh, you know, grappling situation, and I always try to be close, I take this arm and try to always slide it down really fast so I can grab it with my arm, his elbow. And this, I get this idea when I was training Wing Chun and it was one move which we called Stupid Trap. And this is the Stupid Trap because with one arm, I hold his two arms. And if when I'm close, then he is trapped with his arms. And my idea with this technique is that when I'm here, then I go for sweep, so example, Osotogari or some big throw or whatever. Or when I wanna be mean, just whoom, snap his shoulder or whatever. But don't do it. Don't injure your partners or, or your friends. <laughs> just to win sparring. The idea is that you come close, boom, you have a good grip for this underarm what he's holding you, boom. Try to go really deep with this arm. So when you slide it, boom, then you are already ready and try to come close. And of course, in the sparring, this is what I do. I just get this position. Sometimes I just do the step here, just for my information that this is good technique and I could sweep somebody. But normally when I get this technique, I just walk around a little bit and let it go because I don't want to, to do something bad to my sparring partner because he want to try to run away, make some weird move and he can injure himself or I can injure him, him by accident. You know, when he just try to run away this way, he could injure his shoulder or when we move too fast, I could injure his shoulder and I could see some videos when people on BHJ tournament, they get this position and just go fast and snap somebody's shoulder for some, you know, fake price like aluminum poker or aluminum medal. And this is just stupid. Of course, for somebody, oh, I won the tournament, but the truth is that you just want a new dust collector like I have over there. This is just collecting, you know, dust. So, just be smart, you should put your ego to the pocket and don't win for all costs. If it's a life and death situation, of course, just snap somebody's shoulder. But if it's just a tournament or training, just look out for yourself and don't end somebody's maybe future career or maybe you know, somebody's life just because you want to win sparring or some match. Be smart about it. So one more time, the technique. We just go here, boom. We have this good uh, grip here. Then, shoom, hop. We grab the elbow and we are here. And then we can just go for some kind of sweep or big throw or whatever. 
but normally in the fighting, like in the sparring or in the training, I just do hold here and then I'll grab, grab here, walk a little bit and let go because this is just information for me that I did this technique or how I want it. And this is not too deadly technique to, to do it. You can do it, but be smart about it. And I do this almost all the time when I train in some grappling situation. And if I have a chance, I was trying to go for, the, for this technique, but I never finished. And yeah, this is it. Thank you for watching. See you next time.